Illinois police say it is likely that no charges will be filed against eight and nine year old brothers who officers pepper sprayed on Tuesday because they were carrying large butcher knives. KCCI senior reporter Todd Magel is live in the newsroom tonight and Todd law enforcement experts say the police did the right thing. That's right, Steve. They say police brought this situation under control with the least amount of force, and that is a big deal when you're dealing with kids. It's just a terrible situation for the officer to be in. Kelly Willis is a retired Des Moines police commander turned consultant and has just about seen it all. So he understands the concern when police pepper spray two kids accused of stealing food from a quick trip here at East 14th and Euclid. When officers caught up with the kids after a foot chase in a field near the store, they saw the eight and nine year old brothers were carrying large butcher knives. The kids say they were carrying them for protection, but police didn't know that at the time. Believe me, the officers don't want to do anything to an eight or nine year old that they don't have to do. So this was really a minimal use of force and a marked decision that they made in a rather volatile time frame. Remember, you're probably looking at a second half or two seconds to make this decision. Police are trained to deal with all kinds of unusual situations. In this case, one solution is the 21 foot rule. Within 21 feet, uh, there's been lots of officers who have lost their lives. If, if someone with a knife, especially a chef's knife or a butcher knife, a long bladed knife is within you, they can actually kill you and mortally wound you before you can pull your service weapon and shoot, uh, make a shot to stop that threat. And once again, the kids will not receive, we're told, any punishment from police, but they were told turned over to their stepmother, and that could be a different story. Steve?